Urban Jungle, episode 2. Why I am doing this. That was the credit music, it's not great. Good morning! Ah! Flexibility of the wrist. Good morning, everybody! It's Dimitri for Urban Jungle. Uh, so, today it's a fantastic day. It's uh, 5.45 a.m. I got up quite early at 5.15, which is fine. Uh, and here I'm on my little uh, balcony in the forest. It's quite nice. So you enter through here. And you come here and you're like, oh wow, there's this beautiful rock formation here. And then you go there and there's this little river, of which I won't give the name because it gives away the name of the national park. Uh, in which I am, and you got uh, this landscape that's very nice. And you can hear uh, the birds, you can hear uh, cockatoos, um, quite noisy, uh, a lot of other birds that I don't know about. And uh, I think I heard a kangaroo this morning uh, jumping, not screaming, but I heard like twick, twick. So maybe a kangaroo. Uh, and the highway, woo, and the highway this way. Uh, where my tent is, which is not good, but we'd get back to that in a moment. All right, so I don't know what to do with the camera, do like that, hey, speak like that, or just show the landscape. I guess I'll just show the landscape. Um, yeah, so yeah, why am I doing this? Um, why am I going in the bush and living in a tent for uh, 30 days or a bit more or a bit less? Depends on what's going to happen. Um, there's different reasons, but um, I was a bit tired of the city, uh, living in the city. Um, the first reason is that I live in Sydney, and the rent is about a thousand bucks a month, uh, which is fair, but it's, I don't know, uh, you can use that money for so many other things that are cool, just than paying a rent. Um, so I bought my tent uh, 300 bucks, um, so if I stay a week and a half, uh, that's like a month of, that's like, um, uh, that's like a rent uh, for 300 bucks. So, so if I can survive 10 days in this bloody park, which is really nice, then uh, it's like uh, living in a in a in an apartment. So it's fine. Um, the other reason why <clears throat> I wanted to do that is that I don't. Uh, when I live in an apartment, I don't really understand. There's too many things. There's too many. Uh, get back to me. <laughs> hey. It's too many yeah, out of focus. Sorry about that. It's too many uh, the view. It's too many things we don't need. Like this, a lot of space. Um, you get a living room. You get a kitchen. You got uh, yeah. I don't know, you got so much space that you pay for and that uh, you don't really need because you you have the space and you you can do things like you own the space, but because of the walls, you don't really feel like you have that space because you're you're in between four walls and you can go in your kitchen and your living room, but yeah, like you don't need all that. And you need more like a horizon, like having no space, having no walls and full space, I mean, like there. And here, um, so I thought I'd keep it secret that I live in the bush. And uh, the first day, first thing I said was to tell everybody what I did, because uh, I'm too proud. Or I don't know, it's just interesting to have uh, different uh, opinions. And. Um, um, I'm disturbed because it's weird to look in the camera. Maybe I look aside. Yeah, and shit, I really don't know what I was talking about. Yeah, I've told my friends we don't have the space. Yeah, and I say, hey, I have a very small house but a beautiful garden. <laughs> it's a good joke. It is a good joke, but it's true. Um, like all this space, it's it's mine and not mine, but I can enjoy it. Um, and I'm on my own, that's the crazy thing, it's like no one there to bother me. Uh, it's just my, my whole, my own space. Um, so that's great. Uh, and I feel really relaxed, like I, I slept very well, although I'm near the highway. Uh, I slept very well. And um, yeah, there's no one else here. That's good. It's, it looks like it's not good, but it's good. And a few other points. Um, I have a paper, of course, I'm not, I'm not improvising, that'd be too hard. No, 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 okay. Yeah, and the thing I'm trying to, uh, that I hope is going to happen, but I'm not sure, is the 
connection with nature. So, well, we're all connected with nature, I suppose. But um, there's this book by um, Sylvain Tesson, French writer, who wrote uh, in the forest of Siberia. And he, uh, he's been doing a retreat in um, Siberia for six months uh, in a little hut. And he says that after a few weeks, he, he could perceive things that he couldn't before, like noises and different colors of snow. And uh, yeah, um, temperature, I don't know, different things. And uh, I believe that's possible. I mean, I, I understand this totally. And so I, I hope that this is going to happen to me uh, after a while, although it's probably gradual. But um, yeah, but being here, wake up in the morning and you hear the cockatoos. That's a cockatoo there. <laughs> Very noisy. Um, yeah, you wake up in the morning and it's, just, it's quiet and. I don't know, like, I, I, got, I got woken up by the lights, but it was still nighttime. but it's, you don't, I don't know, it's, you get receptive to the things. Um, yeah, and it's, I just slept 8 hours, whereas generally I slept like 9 hours, 10 hours, which is too much. And I slept 8 hours, I feel great, um, and relaxed, so it's good. So it's a good day ahead, and uh, hopefully tonight the rangers haven't found my tent and I can still sleep in it, and it's great. Um, that's the plan. So now I'm going to, uh, I don't know where, because everything is closed because it's too early, because it's 6. But um, yeah, uh, have breakfast somewhere, and then shower and then work. Alright, that's it for today. Urban jungle. Uh, probably the theme for the next one will be what I'm doing, after why I'm doing it. But I'm not sure. <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe I'll be too lazy, and I won't talk about the things. There you go. Alright guys, have a great day, and see you very soon I uh, change the focus. Ah, it's better with a good focus, right? Alright, enjoy the view and enjoy your day. See ya!